The champ appreciates it. Levels. Levels. Good morning, you absolute beauties. It's Sunday morning and I am just outside Brixton Station on my way into Oxford Street to Nike Town, London to hang out with the one and only Kobe Bryant. That's right, NBA five-time winner. I'm talking two-time Olympic gold medalist Kobe Bryant. Now, guys, it's going to be an absolutely epic day. Thanks for joining us on this journey. See you guys soon. Just made it to Nike Town, I can't even lie to you guys, I am hella nervous. But inside there, Kobe Bryant's waiting. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Glad to have you man, the one and only five time NBA champion, two time Olympic gold medalist man. How's it going? It's good to hear that. How's it going? <laughs> How's it going being in London? Yo, it's great, man. It's great. You know, the, the energy here is remarkable. Like the, you know, the passion from the kids. I mean, it's uh, it's uh, it's contagious, man. For the uh, sport bible audience, what's a little? Give us a little bit more about uh, Mamba mentality. Right. The question is, are you getting better every single day? Are you applying yourself in that way? And that's what Mamba mentality is. Who were your heroes then growing up? I, I had a lot of heroes. You know, I, it was um. It, 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 it crossed disciplines. Well, obviously the trophy is here in Nike Town today. You know what I mean? Yeah. You've seen that you kissed that five times. Um, which one of those five was the, the most satisfying win? I think the, the, the last one against the Celtics because that was mm. the hardest one to get. That was the hardest one to get. I mean, they were a great team and we were down 3-2, one game away from losing to the Celtics. Yeah. And, uh, and we came back and won, you know, even being down 15 points in game seven. It's the hardest one to get, and you know, and, 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 you know, it's just like it's, it, when things are really, really difficult, and it seems like you won't get them. Yeah. And then you overcome the odds and you win. That's always that's the, the most. That's yeah. the sweetest, yeah. sweetest victory. That's the best way to win. Yes, it's best the most way to win. Man. When you come back from behind, when you come back, when when the stocks are down, do you know yes. what I mean? Yeah. That's it. It's like a it's like a film, right? Like the, the the guy's on the journey, he's down and out, and there's no way he can overcome that, right? And then he finally overcomes it and makes the film better. Love it. How can we help basketball to grow in the UK, kind of like other sports, like NFL is majorly growing in the UK. How can we push basketball to the upper echelons? Um, I, just continuing to work at it every single day. The, the, the explosion of the game happens when you have a player that transcends culture. Yeah. Right, And that'll come because there, there are players here that are physically gifted and can do that. Absolutely. But it'll take one player, it'll take two players, and all of a sudden, boom, there it is. Absolutely love it. Well, the final question is obviously me and you today, we're, we're heading down to the Tottenham game. Yeah. We're going we're gonna to catch some, some football, as yeah. we call it over here. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, do, you, do, you, do you watch much football? Do you catch it? I do. So, like, when I grew up in Italy, that's the time where, like, La Sadia was the oh. best league in the world, right? And so, I was a uh, um, massive... Say that, say that again for them. Listen. La Sadia. La Sadia. Ooh, listen, I can't even do that. Yeah. <laughs> I can't even do that. <laughs> no, that, that's, that's, that's when the league was the best in the league. So, I, I was very fortunate to grow up around some of the best football that's been played. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, I'm an absolutely huge, huge fan. Who's, who's your teams, then? Who's, who are you looking out for? Football well, look, you know, um, Barcelona. Um, and most recently, I had a chance to visit PSG. <sighs> Listen. And catch up with Neymar <laughs> and Donny Allen and those guys and see what they're what trying to do. And yeah. them, you know. um, so, uh, you know, PSG has been the new addition to the family. <laughs> any, any Premier League teams? Um, to be honest with you, uh, Man City. Man City. Man, that breaks my heart. Yeah, that. yeah, see, that, that's, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, um, Man City's been been a team that I've been. It's uh, uh, they're they're doing well, some Pat, you know, Pat Pat. Yeah, he, I mean, you know, it goes back it goes back to the Barca days and like I, I think the football the style of football the brand of football that he that that he teaches the tiki taka style yeah. is something that is very very entertaining and, and I love the way they play in triangles I love the way they set up combinations and all sorts of stuff it's just it's fun to watch so I I, I enjoy the way he teaches this guy knows yeah. his football you know what I'm saying oh, Listen, Kobe Kobe's about you oh, know no, no I'm about that life now. <laughs> 
<laughs> about He's about life. that life. Yeah, yeah. Hey, listen, much, much love for having you, man. Thank you. Do you know what I mean? It was, it's been an absolute pleasure. Thank um, you. And we'll do this again soon. Yes, indeed, man. Appreciate <laughs> it. <laughs> Thank you. Absolutely epic day. That's all we've got time for today, folks. So make sure you like, share, comment, and hit that subscribe button. Who knew? All right. Who knew Kobe was a football man? Listen, listen, legendary. I know, I know he's a city man. Hardly forgive me for that. But he's a football man. That's good enough for me. Anyway, guys, hope you've enjoyed the video. Make sure you share this bad boy. And um, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Come on!